Hey everybody, it's Darren from Billy's Landing. Darren and Billy Elbert here. He's one of our guides. Um, we are going to do the one cast for you today. It is Monday the 26th, I believe. Um, but we boated up just above the Narrows, pretty much in the Narrows right now. And we're going to throw a double scud rig. Um, we got a, is that 8th ounce? Uh, 16th. 16th ounce weight there. And then a foot behind it, we got a scud. Or two foot behind it, and then another foot behind it, we got another scud. We're just gonna drag them on the bottom. It's trashy. Is it? <clears throat> so I had the water off all morning, and then about one o'clock, they turned on looks like a couple generators. Um, some of the guides were out this morning early. Water was off. Some of them caught them real good on midges, right? Mm -hmm. Midges under float just up above us here is where. And then, uh, Yeah. <laughs> so when you turn the generators on, there's a, it caused a lot of crap to be put in the water. Start flowing down through. So just before Billy came and got me, he was catching fish up here doing this. <laughs> but as always, you turn on the camera. <laughs> and all this stuff got washed down the water and was a lot cleaner when I was up here a second ago. Yeah. So he said the water was a lot cleaner when he was up here before. And then we could hear that. It is like a little stain now. There, I felt the bottom. Yeah, and you can see tons of clumps of moss in the water. Yep, and she's filthy. Yeah. I feel like mine's got stuff on it. You may have to run up and try to get above it. Yeah. So as you can see, there's a bunch of crap in the water. <laughs> Just collect on there before it even gets down. Yep. Yep, we're already heavy again. We may have to abort this. Abandon ship. Abandon ship. Yeah, it's just big clumps, man. Yeah, you can tell when it picks it up, it raises it right up. Yep. Yeah, I almost there we go. Yeah. Go on up. Yeah, let's go. I'm good. There it is. So we're going to make a run farther up, try to get above it all. 
All right, we're back. So we came up here right above outlet three. Got to about point round, the water cleared up. There's not as much trash. And we kind of scouted a little area right below outlet three where we saw a bunch of fish. Yeah, water definitely cleaned up a ton. Yeah, it's completely different. There we go. <laughs> and it's clean, no junk on it. That line of fish is over here on our right. Right there. Are you feeling about him? Oh yeah. I'm not feeling it at all. Yeah, there's a bunch of them over here. Yeah, there's a bunch of them over here too, yeah. Yeah, I was about to go into a bunch of fish right when he ate it. <laughs> he said not yet. <laughs> no, he's feisty. Where's that guy at? <laughs> Grab and show them. Show them. Got it. No, you don't have to. Fish on is good. Thanks, sir. Yes, sir. It's the first fish I've caught on a scud in probably mm, 10 years. <laughs> so every other time I fish them, I just don't catch them on scuds. So. <laughs> this is pretty short. We probably have to run back up there. Too. Yeah. Yeah, it's right over that flat, I think. Funny when you get it right, they bite pretty quick. Yeah, it doesn't take long. <laughs> Yeah, this is just a deep. Yeah, we can run up there real quick. Make it quick. We're just gonna run right back up to where we started again. I know you were kind of stacking them up on this side, that's why. Still good. 
So I always tell people when they come in the office and ask where to fish and what to use and that kind of thing, I always tell them that if they find a pile of fish that are eating and they catch one, just keep going over that same spot. For sure. Yeah, and this is, this is what I mean. If you, if you find a fish that are biting, <laughs> you just keep going over them, picking them off until they stop. Yep. A little fear around them. Not biting, change. Change, yeah, yeah. What he says is, if you're not, if you're around them, they're not biting. You see them, change what you're using. You get it? <laughs> Perfect. Got him. Oh yeah, he came unhooked. Perfect. <laughs> so this is why we use rubber nets too. <laughs> you end up not hooking the nets. You just go around them. Oh, yeah, it's your turn, Billy. He stole my... Man, he wrapped it up good. Still not as bad if it was a nylon net. Right, yeah. <laughs> It'd be in there for forever. <laughs> Four. <laughs> Yeah, what's going on there? Go. Something. Then of course I reel it up. You're getting bit so fast you won't have to get there I know, it's gonna be done before I even get up there. Straight out ahead of you. Buddy. Yeah. You can cast over there, that's where they're at, is right there. Yeah, I just didn't want to cut you off. No, nah, you're good. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, yeah. There's just a pile of them right there. It's your turn. It's a guy's job to put you on <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> but you need to catch one too while we're out there. <laughs> I just like being neck guy. Neck <laughs> We're gonna need a bigger boat. Boy, for going through all that change, they're not being too picky right now. Right, yeah. yeah. Oh, he's unhooked. Oh, come, come, come. Yeah, sweet. <laughs> oh, goodness. Good one. There we go. Another nice one. Oh. Be free, little fella. Good. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. What are you going to do? Swap sides? Mm -hmm. Go over here and go down this spot? Yeah, we can do that. Or you want to go back up? I don't care. I don't care if we swap sides. Let's do that. There was a pile of fish there. Sorry, I don't know how long my mic was hanging off. <laughs> so there's just a pile of fish right there on a the, on the big flat. You can see them all. He was just, Billy was just setting the boat so we could drift right through him. Right there. Yeah, that was a big one too. Was it? 
Go for it. Many years back, it was still easier for me to use my foot than the most. I know, me too. <laughs> I used the, uh, was a pontoon eight one time? <laughs> and I was not good at using the remote at all. <laughs> <laughs> <Even> all on. <laughs> yeah, I know. I didn't know you had to push it and then it stayed on and then you had to push again and turn it off. <laughs> in circles. <laughs> yep. <laughs> going to be pretty deep on that. Yeah, it is. We get right past that tree, I'll shell up the one. Yep, yep. Yeah. That's usually, I'll usually just cut in at that tree. And yeah. It's all right. Shows on the schedule there's two going, two generators going on the Core Engineers app. It said one, not even one, but we think it's like two and a half rolling right now, two and a half generators. Definitely good. Yeah, it's a lot more than one. <laughs> yeah. And way more than none. And way more than none, yeah. <laughs> I'm bumping every once in a while. It's beautiful. Yeah. One of the piles of boulders that they put in. Mm-hmm. And I learned a lot about this when I saw it low. <laughs> yeah. So up there used to be a trough before the first flood. Up there, like about outlet two-ish. Mm-hmm. And that fish would hang in there like crazy. Right. Yeah. And then when that first flood hit, it kind of flattened all that out. When they put in the, the boulders <clears throat> between outlet one and two, there was a good pile that you could stand on. You could stand on them, and mm -hmm. the channel was right there on the outside edge of the boulders. Oh, so you could see all the fish, and you'd just sight fish all day long. That's what those guys this morning were yeah. having so much fun. <laughs> He's like, hey, there's one coming for us. <laughs> Watch we him eat it. Him. Like, Did he just eat it? I'm like, yep, dirt. <laughs> yep, is that the hook? <laughs> like that one? <laughs> I didn't deserve that. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> that might be a decent one, huh? I was a little late. <laughs> yeah, it might be a nice one. Oh, yeah. Not bad. Oop, I reeled that way I too far in. Right. So I just pulled the rookie mistake. <laughs> That's okay. The little 16th ounce weights fit through the eyes of the rod. Pretty easy. He's pretty son of a gun. Mm -hmm. Did and you? Been colored up oh, it's screwed on there. I mean, yeah. There's a cheek on that, dude. Yeah. You don't get any prettier. <laughs> I'm always fighting with this mic. Yeah, man, there's a bunch right here. Here, I'll net him. Just get in there. Okay. Fun. All right. Yeah. We'll multi-pass. Let me throw over you. I'll just walk in front of me and get around me there. Oh, yeah, there's a pile of them over there. Just like yeah. up there. Exactly the same. Yep. 
They ain't got no quid in them up here, do they? Mm -mm. <laughs> Keep it. That's a good one, though. Yeah. It's a chunker. It is a chunker. Sorry, whack the camera with the <laughs> with the net. <laughs> nice. He actually ate it or not, but the yeah, the SE ones. <laughs> Piles of them right there. There was a bunch of fish right there. <laughs> Time to get oh yeah, they're still there. <laughs> uh, no, I'm no, it's fine. <laughs> I'm good. I'll just cast a little farther. <laughs> Good. If I try to sit or sometimes that gut's pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I'm so focused over there, I just look over here and there's fish right here. Of course, the current's taking it over there in front of you. Oh, I just missed one. You just miss one? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even try. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> if I'd have cast all the way, I'd have been in the boat. <laughs> I would have paid attention. right below the boat. That's okay. <laughs> Easy to feel bottom right there. <laughs> right. Thank you. Got it. Another one. I'd say they're eating scuds pretty good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yep. Go after Ron. Get me a drink of tea. All right. No, I brought a water. Being down here and it's cooler, it didn't, it's not bad right now. You want it in the cooler? No, no, no. 
So sitting at the dock, it felt like it was about 150 degrees, and yeah, it's pretty okay now. Out here now, it's not bad. <laughs> I think I got mossed up. <laughs> Oh, he was chasing the sky. <laughs> I thought it was a big chunk of moss and there was a fish chasing it. <laughs> so we were down by Monkey Island early this morning and the guy starts reeling it in. Yeah. And I stand up and I look and I'm like, kill it. <laughs> and he goes, huh? And stops reeling and he goes, what? <laughs> he goes, well, that was awesome. <laughs> that was nice. They're jumping. Yeah, they're jumping now. Just a lot deeper here. Mm -hmm. Right where that rolls off. Or... Where that color changes. Mm -hmm. This spot was real. This stretch was really good earlier this year. Yeah. It's been kind of a ah, mess lately. I didn't get over far enough. It's all right. Yeah, I remember when I got it, I fished this a lot and oh, yeah. caught them good along here. Oh yeah. This, this, earlier this year, man, this was, was on fire. Yeah. And we caught some nice ones right through here. Yeah. Dirty yeah, it got dirty again. Yep. Run back up. We can if you want to. Up to you. Up to you. Or we can just fish this little flat right here. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah, might be good. Try to get over here, maybe it'll be a good little cleaner. Yeah, yeah. I think they'd stack up here just like on that other flat. They should. It's just dirtier. I'm rehydrated and ready. <laughs> Throw into the grass. <laughs> when I lived in Point Royal, mm -hmm. even this water, I would walk, I could walk up and wade and fish all that behind there. Right. That was fun. Yeah. Because it was so weightable and... There was two times, two or three times, where I waited across, water was off, and they turned on, I'm like, I can get across. <laughs> Start to, nope, and I had to call Steve Dickey, and he had to come pick me up. <laughs> can you come get me? I'm stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I was glad he had his boat on the river all the time. <laughs> yeah, I saw that one <laughs> right when I looked at your eyes. <laughs> Oh, wax <laughs> oh, they come off. Quickly. <laughs> Still counts.
got junk. Yep. Oh yeah. <laughs> that thing I didn't even have to slide out of my line. <laughs> Just took off with it, huh? I'm lucky that, that didn't like go uh, slack, slack line and snap off. Gosh. <laughs> yeah, I'd say it's safe to say they're going to eat a scud right now. Yeah, they're on the scuds pretty good. Lordy. <laughs> I lost my lost. <laughs> oh yeah, I got a lot of moss. When it feels a lot heavier than it should, yeah, like that felt like, <laughs> felt like there's fish on there. <laughs> At least they're biting yours. I'm not biting mine anymore. Move, it, move out a little. Oh, over there? Yeah, you're in the shallow. For whatever reason, they haven't really stuck behind that yet. They still. <laughs> I'm <lower. laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm just swinging it now in the current <laughs> instead of dragging it. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Caught moss. We're not catching them as as well now. I think our water just got dirty. Yeah, the water got dirty, and it's deeper here. So they were in those shallows, on those flats, <clears throat> and they were literally stacked up there. I just think there was more fish yep. up there. For sure. That's why if you catch a couple, you just keep going over them. <laughs> Once they stop biting, run back up and go over them again. I think that'll do it for today. Caught a few fish. Saw how to use the double scud rig. I hadn't caught a scud in a long time, so it's kind of nice. Uh, thanks for watching. Y'all have a good day. Thanks, Billy. Hey, buddy. <laughs>